shows are shortening their formats and delaying their broadcasts, and some movies continue to be streamed on Netflix and other platforms. Academy Award-winning actor George Clooney produced, directed, and starred in that sci-fi film, The Midnight Sky. Critics' Choice member Felipe Solis is here now to tell us if this film is an award contender. So, Felipe, what's the verdict? <laughs> <laughs> okay, so here's here's the problem, and here's the problem. The problem is watching movies and not being able to see them on the big screen. And I know some people are, and they're trying, but the majority of moviegoers can't. So I think a lot of movies, like The Midnight Sky, loses a lot of translation when you can't see the film on the big screen. Um, it's on Netflix, it's streaming, uh, so yes, you can lie down and take a snooze in the middle of anything, which I kind of did in this movie, and let me tell you why. Uh, so it's the story of a man by the name of Augustine Lofthouse, who, um, this is a sci-fi kind of post-apocalyptic film where he is trying to, from the Arctic, determine where there are habitable planets for the future. It made me think that it was trying to be gravity meets E.T. And it slows down in a lot of places. So getting to the actual final moment of, oh, this is what happens in his life, there's a lot in between. There's a lot of CGI. There's a lot of, again, incredible um, cinematography and the way things are placed is, is really interesting. But it just doesn't cut to the chase fast enough. And when it gets to the chase, you're kind of tired of chasing your tail. Well, thank you so much, Philippa, for giving us your perspective on the movie. And it's always great to have you on. Um, oh, thank you. More coming up. We'll have some exciting interviews coming up, so stay tuned. <laughs> thank you, Philippa. We'll be right back after.